If you haven't seen the video, this is my new office. It's raised off the ground to maximize space in the workshop. Underneath is where a bunch of rolling storage carts will live for easy access. Every surface of the office has the potential to increase functionality. So today, I'll be making some important updates to the front of the office. The first thing I want to add is power. This is a great central place to charge camera batteries and stuff. So just having power access here will only improve the potential. I got a long strip plug that spans out across the front and attached it to the wall. I ran the cable under the office and plugged it into an outlet off to the right behind lumber storage. After using the strip for a little while, I realized that six plugs gets used up pretty quickly. So I added another one and ran it back the same way. One thing I really wanted here is a centralized location for all of my camera gear. Over the years, things have been scattered around, but it would be really nice to look in one box and find everything. I sized up some dimensions, made a plan, and got to cutting. This box will have an angled top and a hinged lid, so the top edge of the back wall had to be cut at an angle for clearance. I had some bad luck with nails shooting out the sides but eventually got it all sorted out. This thing will be mounted with a French cleat. So I put one cleat on the back of the box and one cleat on the wall. The lid was the last thing to go on. I had to sand down an edge to make room for the hinge pin. The reason for the lid is to prevent a majority of the dust from going into the box. The lid will keep it mostly sealed and clean. I added a few holes in the back to run charging cables into the box. It looked good up on the wall, and it'll be really nice to have one place for all of my camera gear. This is an extra TV that has been unused for a while. I commandeered it for the workshop and picked up a maneuverable arm to mount it on the wall. I know that this isn't necessarily a tool like the other things, but this puts the fun in functional. I added a fire stick so I can play movies or shows in the background while I work but most importantly, so I can watch baseball and keep track of the Dodgers on their way to a World Series win. I tidied up the cables and plugged them into the strip plug below. Tatis, off the three bouncer, off the paint, your ricochets to Simmons, tries to get rid of it quickly, and he got him. What a plug by Anderson Simmons will down. Baseball. I have a few different Ryobi chargers, but I consolidated all those into this new six port charger.
I added a magnetic strip to be able to hold some metal and magnetic things to the wall. A few years ago, I built a large machine for Kurt Schneider in an M&M sponsored video. I kept the large candy holders at the top of the machine. So now, one of them gets a spot atop my office. Unfortunately, there just wasn't enough room for both. I added a few more things to the wall, and I'm sure I'll continue to add more over time. But for the grand finale, la creme de la crop, is my freshly delivered 100,000 subscriber play button. This wouldn't be possible without all of you subscribing and tuning in each week. So thank you. It's really cool to be able to put this up top the wall. Onward we go. Okay, that's it for now. See ya. Did it work?